Tonight, a closer look at the moment Chicago Fire Department diver Juan Busio went into distress and had to be rescued. Busio was later pronounced dead at the hospital. And tonight, a live look outside his firehouse where bunting now drapes the building. Good evening, I'm Rob Johnson. And I'm Erica Sargent. CBS2 was on the scene as rescue crews tried to pull Busio from the water. To investigator Dave Savini begins our team coverage. We warn you, though, the video may be difficult for some to watch. You're listening to and watching the final moments of veteran Chicago firefighter and scuba diver Juan Busio's life. Busio and his partner were dropped off by helicopter and had already been in the water for some time searching for a missing man. Our CBS photographer Scott Placco was videotaping the river rescue when he suddenly captured Busio in trouble. Listen as crews on the boat yell out to Busio and his partner. Diver, let's go! But Busio and his dive partner are still in trouble. You then see Busio disappear and go under near the front of the rocking boat. And the other diver puts his hands on the side of the boat to also avoid going under. What are you doing? They throw a rope to the other diver who is also still in the water. But as he's pulled out, there is still no sign of Busio. You can hear radio traffic between boats as they now realize Juan Busio has not surfaced. Still unsure of what happened to Busio, they talk to his partner. Three vital minutes pass in this video before other divers are sent in to find him. Eventually, his body is found. The chief in charge of safety for the Chicago Fire Department came to CBS 2 to watch our video today. He could not comment, but we had many questions, like why at least what appears to be a three-minute delay in sending the other divers which were on that boat into the water to look for Busio. Dave Savini, CBS 2 Investigators.